Hello students, welcome back to my channel. Today, I am giving you the some exercises of transpiration class 10 ICC as well as CBSE. Right? First, just look at here. Name the following. Permanent opened pores in the bark of the old woody trees, they are lanticles. An apparatus used for measuring the rate of transpiration, it is photometer. Maybe Ganong's photometer or maybe farmer's photometer. A plant in which stomata are sunken, that is in case of xerophytes. Name of the plant? Nerium, right? An apparatus to compare the rate of transpiration in a cut shoot. It is Garrow's photometer. G A R R E A U apostrophe S photometer, right? Kidney shaped cells present at the borders of stomata, they are guard cells. Respiratory openings found on the stem of woody plants, they are lenticles. Exudation of sap from the injured parts of a plant, it is called bleeding. The loss of water from injured parts of a plant is known as exudation, right? The wax like layer. On the epidermis of the leaves, which reduces transpiration, it is thick cuticle. Clear? Given below are certain biological statements, which are incomplete and hence incorrect. So, rewrite the correct form of the statement by inserting suitable word or words at right place. Do not delete any word already given in the statement. Underline the inserted word or words. Now here, the given sentence, transpiration is the loss of water from the leaves of a plant. The correct sentence, transpiration is the loss of water vapor. Whatever you have to underline that I have written here. Loss of water vapors from the leaves of a plant. Right? The opening and closing of stomata is controlled by kidney shaped guard cells. Nearly kidney shaped guard cell. More transpiration occurs from the dorsiventral leaf. More transpiration occurs from the lower surface of dorsiventral leaf. Lower surface of at this stage. More transpiration occurs from the lower surface of dorsiventral leaf. Right? Guttation is the loss of water along the margins of the leaf. Guttation is the loss of water droplets along the margins of the leaf. It is, guttation is the loss of water droplets along the margins of the leaf. Or you can say water solution along the margins of the leaf. Because water emitted from here, it contains organic and inorganic salts also. Bleeding is the exudation of sap or watery solution from the part of a plant. Bleeding is the exudation of sap, watery solution from the cut or injured part of here. From the cut or injured parts of a plant. This will be cut or injured from this place. From the cut or injured parts of a plant. I hope it is clear. Now, state whether true or false. Rewrite the false statements in the correct. Rate of transpiration is directly proportional to the surface area of the leaves. Yes. The statement is the rate of transpiration is directly proportional to the surface. The more surface area, the more transpiration. The less surface area, the less transpiration. Plants transpire more in high humid conditions outside the plant. The statement is wrong. The plants respire in place of more, it will be less. Plants respire, respire less in high humid conditions outside the plant. Statement is false and rewrite 
in place of more it will be less bleeding in plants takes place because of reduced root pressure it is false wrong statement bleeding in plants takes place because of high in place of reduced it will be high root pressure right stomatal pores open or close in response to the tugger pressure of the guard cells it is false stomatal pores open in response to the tugger pressure of the open or close nahi stomatal pores open in response to the tugger pressure of the guard cell the statement is false wrong transpiration is more from the upper surface of the leaf as compared to the lower surface in a dense ventral leaf it is wrong transpiration is less in place of more less from the upper surface of the leaf as compared to the lower surface of the leaf or transpiration is more from the lower surface of the leaf as com uh, compared to the more to the lower surface of the leaf as compared to the higher surface ya to aap isko compare kar denge upper or higher karenge ya aap kahenge is less from the upper surface of the leaf as compared to the lower surface in a dorsal leaf dorsi ventral leaf mein लोअर सरफेस से ज्यादा स्टोमेटा होते हैं क्योंकि उसमें डिफ्यूज सनलाइट होती है तो इसलिए उसमें ट्रांसपेरेशन ज्यादा और अपर सरफेस में नंबर ऑफ स्टोमेटास कम होते हैं इसलिए अपर सरफेस में ट्रांसपेरेशन कम होता है ओके लिस्ट थ्री एक्सटर्नल फैक्टर्स दैट इंक्रीज द रेट ऑफ ट्रांसलेट तो व्हाट आर द थ्री दैट नाउ लुक एट हियर द थ्री एक्सटर्नल फैक्टर्स दैट इंक्रीज द रेट ऑफ ट्रांसपेरेशन फर्स्ट इंक्रीज इन टेंपरेचर इंक्रीज इन टेंपरेचर decrease in the relative humidity of the air and it increases the rate of transpiration next increase in the intensity of the more high intensity of the light more transpiration less intensity of the light low transpiration fall in vapor wave see if the vapor uh, water vapors in the atmosphere are more the transpiration will be less if the water vapors are less means high temperature then the transpiration will be more and when the leaves are exposed to the wind agar hawa tez chal rahi hai to transpiration zyada hoga agar hawa nahi chal rahi hai to transpiration kam right now see the next one give the brief account of the significance of transpiration significant see significance kya hai ascent of sap absorption of water more and more water transpired जितना ही वाटर ट्रांसफायर होगा उतना ही एब्जॉर्ब होगा तो उतना ही एसेंट ऑफ सैप क्या होगा सैप क्या है वाटर मिनरल्स डिजोल्व इन वाटर मिनरल्स डिजोल्व इन वाटर दे आर कॉल्ड एज सैप एब्जॉर्बन तो जितना ही ट्रांसपायरेशन होगा वाटर उतना ही ज्यादा एब्जॉर्ब होगा ट्रांसपोर्ट ऑफ द मिनरल्स जितना ही ज्यादा वाटर वेपर एब्जॉर्ब होगा उतना ही वाटर प्लांट के दूसरे पार्ट्स में ट्रांसलोकेट होगा और उतना ही ज्यादा वो मिनरल्स होता है और जितना एवेपोरेट होगा प्लांट उतना ही कूल रहेगा जितना एवेपोरेशन होगा इसलिए जो नॉर्मल टेम्परेचर उससे चार पाँच दो से पांच डिग्री तक टेम्परेचर जो है लीफ का कम होता है राइट नाउ कॉमेंट ऑन द प्लांट्स हैव टू पे द प्राइस ऑफ फोटोसेंसिस इन द फॉर्म ऑफ ट्रांसपायरेशन सी ड्यूरिंग ट्रांस फोटोसेंसिस वॉटर एन कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड प्लस वॉटर they combine carbon dioxide plus water in presence of sunlight and chlorophyll they form glucose and oxygen is given out evolved so here what happens the more and more water is transpired the more and more photosynthesis is there तो उसमें जब फोटोसेंसिस होगी तो वॉटर ट्रांसपायर कम और जब फोटोसेंसिस नहीं होगी तो वॉटर ट्रांसपायरेशन कम होगा Transpiration is a necessary evil. Yes, transpiration is a necessary because it cannot be checked. Transpiration को हम control नहीं है. Transpiration लगातार होता रहता है जब तक कि plant में पानी रहेगा. तब तक वो इसलिए देखिए अगर आप पेड़ों को पानी ना दें, if you don't water the plant, the plants will wilt. So as long as the water is there in the plant, it goes on transpiring. We can't check it. That's why transpiration is a necessary evil. some plants so wilting on their leaves even when the soil is well watered 
wilting rate because absorption of water is less as compared to the evaporation of water so the leaves wilt but during the night when the temperature goes down rat wilt the then the wilting uh, wilting does not occur temporary wilting is there but then also if the wilting occurs then it is the permanent wave wilting and then later on the plant dries away सम प्लांट दे विल्टिंग इन दियर लीव इवन वेन द सॉइल इज वेल वाटर तो उसमें क्या होता है जो एब्जॉर्बन रेट कम होता है ट्रांसपायरेशन रेट पर ए हायर रेट ऑफ ट्रांसपायर इज रिकॉर्डेड ऑन विंडी डेज लेदर ऑन ए काम डे रेट ऑफ ट्रांसपायरेशन हायर होता है विंडी डे में जब जब विंड चल रही होगी ऑन ए विंडी डे द रेट ऑफ एवोपोरेशन द वाटर जो वाटर ड्रॉपलेट्स हैं वो उसमें स्टे नहीं करेंगे हवा के साथ पानी उठ जाता है एवोपोरेट हो जाता है तो उसमें क्या होता है रेट ऑफ ट्रांसपायरेशन ज्यादा होता है ड्यूरिंग द डे ऑफ ट्रांसपायरेशन एंड फोटोसेंसेस आर इंटरलिंग यस बिकॉज इन ट्रांसपायरेशन वाटर इज एवोपोरेटेड इन द फॉर्म ऑफ वाटर एंड ड्यूरिंग फोटोसेंसेस वी वाटर इज कंज्यूम्ड ओवर देयर फॉर द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ ग्लूकोज सो दे आर इंटरलिंग द लीव्स ऑफ प्लांट्स रोल अप इन ए ब्राइट सनी डे द सेम आंसर द रीज ब्राइट सनी बिकॉज ऑन ब्राइट सनी डे द रेट ऑफ absorption of water is less than the rate of transpiration of water water transpire zyada ho jata hai heat ki wajah se utna water absorb nahi ho pata the rate of evaporation is higher than the rate of the rate of transpiration is higher than the rate of absorption so the plants roll up on a bright sunny day now the definition transpiration as you know already see transpiration you had it here the loss of water in the form of vapors from the aerial parts of a plant is called as transpiration gutation as you know here gutation loss of cell sap or watery solution through the hyzer roots from the margins or tips of the leaves of the certain plants without injury bleeding bleeding you can see it here loss of cell sap or watery solution from the cut or injured parts of a plant photometer an apparatus used to measure the rate of transpiration is photometer wilting folding or rolling of leaves when the rate of transpiration through the leaves is more as compared to the rate of absorption hydrothotes see these are the hydrothotes water present water pores present on the margins and tips of the leaves consisting of loosely arranged colorless cell that is called as the hydrothotes next differentiate between the following transpiration and evaporation now see here transpiration it is a physiological process to get rid the excess of water evaporation it is purely a physical process transpiration it is regulated by the movements of guard cells evaporation it is not regulated by the guard cell or any living cell it is uh, regulated by the living cells it is regulated by non living cells it usually occurs at day time but it occurs at all the time evaporation whether day or the night if the height is there the evaporation continues to go transpiration and gutation now here you can see transpiration and gutation under transpiration water escapes in the form of water vapor gutation water escapes from the pores on the margins of the leaves in the form of water droplet here in case of transpiration water escapes through stomata and lenticles in transpiration a uh, gutation water escapes through the hydrothotes only in it is regulated by guard cell it is due to the gutation is due to the root pressure transpiration occurs only the day time it occur gutation occurs at the night stomatal and lenticular transpiration now here you see stomatal and lenticular transpiration the loss of water vapors through the stomata is called stomatal transpiration whereas loss of water through lenticles is called lenticular transpiration stomatal it is 90% of the total water loss lenticular it is 1 to 2% of the total water loss 
stomatal they open and close with changes in the turgor pressure of the guard cell whereas lenticulus they remain open all the time right stomata and hydathodes stomata they are present on the surface of the leaves and uh, hydathodes present on the margins of the leaves they only pure water is lost in the form of water vapors through the stomata here water lost contains organic and inorganic substance stomata they are surrounded by guard cell here they are surrounded by intracellular spaces loosely arranged parenchymatous right now here the next you have gutation and bleeding in plants here you see gutation and bleeding in plants gutation occurs due to hydrostatic pressure is built up in the xylem cell where is bleeding uh, your answer that is the cause there is a bleeding in plants it is occurs due to root pressure phloem pressure or the local pressure in xylem cells right list the three morphological adaptations in the leaves to check the rate of transpiration the three morphological adaptation of leaves to check the rate of transpiration first presence of sunken stomata second thick cuticle and waxy coating and the third leaves are modified into a spine as in cactal in xerophytic plants leaves are modified into a spine to reduce the loss of water next is what is transpiration and mention various kinds of tra see transpiration is the loss of water vapor from the aerial parts of a plant it is of three types stomatal transpiration takes place through the stomata cuticular transpiration takes place through the cuticle and lenticular transpiration takes place through the lenticles right now mention the specific functions the specific functions hydrothoats when the water absorption exceeds that of transpiration then due to hydrostatic pressure water is pushed up in the xylem cells ducts and out through the hydrothoat xylem absorption of water minerals through roots and distribute to the different parts of the lenticles they also lose water vapors and it is called the lenticular guard cells they help in opening guard cells they help in opening and closing of the stomata through which the water vapor is evaporated through the stomata the evaporation of water uh, water through the stomata it is guarded by the guard cells that is what is the functions right okay last exercise i told you the transpiration various kinds of the transpiration and the functions of the some important words like hydrothoats lenticles guard cells etc right now here given below is the diagram of an experiment set up to study the process of transpiration I study the same and answer the question what is the color of the dry, dry cobalt chloride paper the color of the dry cobalt chloride the color of the dry cobalt chloride paper is blue the color of dry cobalt chloride paper it is blue is this experiment leaf a monocot or dicot give a reason it is a dicot because it is dorsi ventral leaf it is flat and in structure if it is isoventral it will be straight one means both side receive the same amount of sunlight but here the leaves we are saying it is like this so it is a diseventral dicot leaf why are glass slides placed over the dry cobalt flavor glass slides are placed so that water cannot be evaporated outside from the surface of the leaf these glass slides are placed water does not evaporate out of the leaf after about half an hour what change if any would you expect to find in the cobalt cobalt chloride paper placed on the dorsal and ventral side will give a reason is supported see after some time when we observe then we see the color of the cobalt leaves on the lower side is going to change to dark pink color where the upper side it is same or slightly going or it will take more time because number of stomata is present on the lower side or more so the rate of transpiration evaporation of water is more on the lower side as compared to the upper side upper side number of stomata are less 
So the rate of transpiration will also be less. Define the trans transpiration, you already know. The process of evaporation of water in the form of water, what in the form of water vapors to aerial parts of plant is called transpiration. Right? Given below are sets of five terms each. In each case, rewrite the terms in the logical sequence as directed at the end of each stadium. Stoma, mesophyll cells, xylem, substomatal stage, tracellular spaces. Loss of water due to transpiration. So first term, first number one, xylem, number two, mesophyll cells, number three, intracellular spaces, number four, substomatal space, and number five, stomata. See, first xylem water is water is uh, moving upward. Through the xylem, it moves to the mesophyll cells. From the mesophyll cells, it passes to the intracellular space. From intracellular space, it moves to the substomatal space. And from substomatal space, it moves to stoma. And then it is evaporated outside. Cortical cells, root hair, soil, water, endodermis, xylem. Entry of water into the plant from the soil. First, soil, water. Then water enters in the soil, water in the soil, it enters into the root hair. From the root hair, it passes into the cortical cells. From cortical cells, it goes into the endodermis. And from endodermis, it moves to the side. Right? Spongy cells, upper epidermis, stoma, palisade tissue, substomatal space. First, the epidermis. Then from epidermis to the palisade tissue. Epidermis ki niche palisade tissue hote. From palisade it goes down to the spongy cells. From the spongy cells it moves to substomatal space. And then from substomatal space it moves to stoma. Right? Given below is the experiment setup for a study of a particular process. See, name the process being studied here that the transpiration occurs in plant. Explain the process name in one above the process. The evaporation of water in the form of water vapors, the evaporation of water in the form of water vapors through aerial parts of plant is called transpiration. Why is the pot covered with the plastic sheet? This pot is covered with the plastic sheet so that evaporation water droplets evaporated only from the leaves and not from the soil inside. So we cover it with the plastic, plastic. so that soil which is present outside the plant. From there, the water evaporated will not be accumulated inside the jar. Mention any one way in which the process is beneficial to the plant. Removal of excess water. There will be the two ways. The removal, one way in which the removal of excess water is removed of the plant. And not only the excess water, it also helps in the absorption of minerals dissolved in water to the plant. Excess water should not be there because it goes on until water is there. This may excess water never and it provides cooling effect. Suggest a suitable control for this experiment. The control if you take a poorly watered plant, then the results can be seen. You are able to check it very carefully. Now, here the next. Give the specific functions that we have already discussed, the which specific functions of the various parts. That is the hydrothodes, xylem, lenticles, and guard cells. Guard cells, they help in opening and closing of the stomata. These guard cells, they help in opening and closing of the stomata, stoma. When they are in turgid condition, the stoma opens. When it is in flaccid condition, then the stoma closes. The diagram below represents the structure found in a leaf. Study the same and answer the following question. Name the parts labeled A and B. A is guard cell. Opening is known as stoma. What is the biological term for the above structure? Biological term for the above, that is, it is a stomatal apparatus. Biological term, it is a stomatal apparatus. What is the function of the part labeled A? Guard cells, they govern opening and closing of stoma. What is the function? Function? They govern opening and closing of stoma. Mention two structural features of A which help in functioning. The two structural features that when they are turgid, the stoma opens. When they are in the flaccid condition, then the stoma closes. When they are in turgid, the stoma opens. When they are in the flaccid condition, 
then the stoma closes. What is the structure likely to be found in the, where is the st structure, this structure is found on the leaf on the surface of the leaf. It is found in the leaf surface. Ye jo surface hoti is surface ke leaf ke upar, yahan pe stomata present hoti. The above structure helps in the process of transfer. Explain the term transformation. We have already discussed a lot. Evaporation of water in the form of water vapor. How many other cells are found surrounding this structure? Seen in the diagram. See, they are the subsidiary cells. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 cells are subsidiary cells which are surrounding stomata. Along with subsidiary cells and guard cells, the structure is known as stomatal apparatus. Now here, choose the correct answer. Loss of water as droplets from hydrotodes. It is called guttation. Which one of the following does not affect the rate of transpiration? Age of the plant. Give exact location. Hydrothotes, they are present on the margins of the leaves. Lanticles, they are present on the stem, branches of the woody plant. Lanticles, they are present on the stem and branches of the woody plants. Now here you can study the diagram below and answer the question. Name the process being studied in this ex experiment. It is the transpiration. Explain the process mentioned, the rate of transpiration, the process of the evaporation of water in the form of water vapors. Why is oil placed over water? Oil is placed so that water should not be evaporated from the test tube. This test tube, jo, uh, ye container, hai, is se water evaporated. Oil is control karega, to se water. Hai. Why do we observe with regard to the level of water when this setup is placed? Bright sunlight, humid condition, will there. Agar bright condition, to leaves se evaporation zyada hoga. Humid condition, to evaporation kam hoga. Or agar windy day hoga, to bhi evaporation zyada hoga. There it will be more evaporation in the windy day, less in the humid condition, more in the bright sunlight. The level of water, zyada hoga, to water ka level ye niche gir jayega. Kam, uh, ye kam hoga, to water ka level bahut kam ya slight change hoga. Windy hoga to be water ka level hai. Mention any three adaptation found in plants to overcome the process mentioned. We have already discussed the three plants to overcome the loss. Now given below is an experiment set up to demonstrate particular purpose. Study the same and answer the question. Name the physiological process being studied here. That the evaporation of water from the surface of the leaf. The process mentioned here. Dorsal surface, ventral surface. Ye dorsal hai. Or ventral niche wali hai. Aim of the is that. To measure the rate of transpiration. What do you observe in the experience setup after an hour? Reason is a word. Ek ghante ke baad hum dekhenge. To jo aapka cobalt chloride. Ye same cobalt chloride paper hai. Jo upar rakha hai, niche rakha hai. To jo upar rakha hai. Wo pig kam hota hai. Niche rakha hai. Uska color zyada change hota hai. This shows that. Rate of evaporation is less on the dorsal surface. Than on the on ventral uh, dorsal surface. Is less. And on the ventral surfaces more. <coughs> Mention any theater on plants to overcome the physiological <coughs> presence of thick critical. <coughs> the leaves are modified into the spines. We have already discussed the three points are there. The increase in the intensity of the light, they are all affect the industry of the light, windy places, they all affect the process. Give the biological technical term for the permanently open structures seen on the bark of an, they are the lenticles, the hydrothotes, they are permanently open. Apparatus that measure the rate of water uptake in the cut shoot to a transpiration. The apparatus it is used to measure the cut rate, it may be the many apparatuses are there. They are the photometer or the slide absorption, this apparatus is also used over there to measure the rate of transpiration. Here we can see the apparatus. To, uh, yeah. Aapka Darwin's photometer hai. Ye cork or test tube or water plant hai. Just don't say by the leafy shoots, by the loss of the weight. Ye aapka test tube experiment hai. Ye aapka Darwin's photometer hai. Ye aapka former spirit of transpiration hai. Or ye aapka demonstrate transpiration pull pressure hai above meter ki tarah. Find the odd one out transpiration, photosynthesis, phagocytosis. Yes, are transpiration related phagocytosis. It is found. They are found in plants. It is found in animal. 
The given below represents an experiment setting up with a weighing machine to demonstrate particular causes. The experiment setup was placed in bright sunlight. Study the diagram. Name the process intended for their test tube to measure the rate of transpiration. The evaporated water. Ye test tubes. Hai. Define the ever mentioned process, the evaporation of water in the form of water vapor. When the weight of the test tube A is taken before and after the what is the observed? पहले लिया था कम था बाद में लिया है ज्यादा है अर्लियर इट वॉज मोर आफ्टर दैट इट इज लेस वेन द वेट इज टेक ए एंड बी बिफोर एंड आफ्टर इन ए पहले दोनों का बराबर होगा सेम होगा आफ्टर सम टाइम इट विल बी रिड्यूस बिकॉज हियर द लीव्स आर ट्रांसपेयर हियर इट विल बी सेम एज दैट ऑफ द लीडर क्यों क्योंकि इसमें वॉटर ट्रांसपायर्ड हुआ है What is the purpose of keeping the test tube in the experiment setup? मतलब ये कि oil रखा है अगर leaves नहीं है तो oil है तो इसमें कोई water transpire नहीं हुआ जब water transpire नहीं हुआ तो इसमें water का level same होगा अब इसमें जो कि plant inserted है तो plants की की कट ट्विक्स अंदर है इस ट्विक से जो roots हैं तो इससे water वाप होगा water होगा तो leaves से water transpire होगा जब leaves से water transpire होगा तो naturally ये water कम होगा और ये level नीचे जाएगा Balsam plants wilt during midday even if the soil is well watered, because the reason is same. The rate of absorption of water is less is compared to the rate of water transpire. ये गैनोंग्स पोटेमीटर है. The diagram of an apparatus given below demonstrates the particular process in plants. Study the same and answer. Name the apparatus Gannon's potometer. What it is? Gannon's potometer. It is Gannon's potometer. Which one is wasted? Is decided. Measure rate of transpiration. What is the rate of transpiration? State two limitations of using this apparatus. The two limitations: the they should be properly waxed. and bubble should be entered carefully what is the importance of the air bubble by the movement of the air bubble only measuring on the scale we are able to read that in how much time how much water is transpired that much air bubble is moved out jitna hi air bubble ka distance travel hoga utna hi water hame isme time note karna padta hai ki kitne time mein air bubble ek jagah se dusri jagah aaye kis time mein what is the importance of the air bubble Name the structure in the plant through which the above process takes place. The structure through which the above evaporation of water, that is the structure takes place, was xylem cells. Give the biological reason for the following. In some zero leaves are modified, leaves are modified into spines to reduce the rate because they grow in the scarcity of water. So to restore the water, stem becomes thick and fragile to store the water, and leaves are modified into the spine. so that water is less transpired and even in some xerophytic plants if the stomata are present they are sunken stomata <coughs> plants growing in a fertilized soil are often found to wilt if the soil is not there agar if it is not adequately watered then what happen concentration of salts is higher in soil and water is less then the plant is not able to absorb the फर्टिलाइजर्स और द सॉइल क्योंकि जब सेल साफ से कंसंट्रेशन ऑस्मोसिस का मूवमेंट तभी होगा जब सोलेंट मॉलिक्यूल्स बाहर कम होंगे और सेल साफ में ज्यादा होंगे जब बाहर अगर फर्टिलाइजर में प्रॉपर वाटर नहीं होगा फर्टिलाइजर ज्यादा होंगे तो मिनरल सॉल्ट का कंसंट्रेशन बाहर ज्यादा होगा जब मिनरल सॉल्ट का कंसंट्रेशन बाहर होगा ज्यादा तो वो प्लांट्स एब्जॉर्ब नहीं कर पाएंगे डायग्राम ये लगभग सेम डायग्राम है ये वाटर्ड प्लांट वाला The diagram represents a process in plant. The setup was placed in the bright light. Answer: Name the physiological process depicted in the diagram. Transpiration. Why was oil added in water? Oil added so that water should not be transpired from the pot. When placed in bright sunlight for four hours, what do you observe with regard to the initial and final weight of the plant? In bright sunlight for four hours, then the इनिशियल जो वेट वाटर का होगा वो ज्यादा होगा चार घंटे धूप में रखने के बाद उसके बाद जब हम वाटर का वेट लेंगे तो वो वाटर का वेट कम होगा वॉट हैपन्स टू द लेवल ऑफ वाटर वेन दिस सेटअप इज प्लेस्ड इन ह्यूमिड कंडीशन ह्यूमिड कंडीशन में 
वाटर का वेट ज़्यादा कम नहीं होगा विंडी कंडीशंस में भी वाटर का वेट कम होगा लेकिन उतना नहीं होगा कम होगा कम लेकिन उतना नहीं कम होगा विंडी कंडीशंस में भी रेट ऑफ ट्रांसपायरेशन ज़्यादा होगा ह्यूमिड कंडीशन में नहीं होगा ब्राइट सनलाइट में ज़्यादा होगा Mentioned any three adaptation found in plants to overcome the process? We have already done it. Now, given below is the apparatus which was settled in the late scientific era. These two measures: name the process being studied, transpiration, define the process, uh, the loss of water from the area. Why was the pot enclosed in a rubber sheet? Rubber sheet kyun? Jisse ki rubber sheet, jisse ki yahan se water transpire na ho. Two external factors which can accelerate the above process. जो टू अडेप्टेशन इन द प्लांट्स टू रिड्यूस द द एब प्रोसेस ड्रॉ नीट लेवल डायग्राम स्टोमेटल एपरेटस स्टोमेटल एपरेटस का डायग्राम यही है बेटा दिस इज द डायग्राम ऑफ द स्टोमेटल एपरेटस नाउ हियर यू सी इट सी एम टू डिमॉन्स्ट्रेट द डिफाइन द प्रोसेस द लॉस ऑफ वाटर वेपर थ्रू एरियल पार्ट्स ऑफ द प्लांट इज कॉल्ड ट्रांसफर इट मोस्टली टेक्स प्लेस थ्रू द स्टोमेटल द व्हाई डू वी ऑब्जर्व द एक्सपेरिमेंट डेंस द प्रोसेस स्टेटेड ए एंड बी The plastic cover over the leaves deposits of water droplets on its inner side after some time. The water droplet must have come from the water vapors evaporated from the surface of the plant, including leaves, which be a stomata. Precautions you take: plant should be well watered before we start the experiment. The plastic bag should be airtight so that water vapors do not escape into the atmosphere. Right? Difference between stomata and lenticel. Stomata they are located on the lower surface of the dicot and both upper and lower surface of the monocot leaves. Lenticles they are located on the stem and branches of the woody plant. The loss of water vapor is termed stomatal transpiration. The loss of water vapor is called the lenticles. They are called the lenticular transpiration. Right? Define ये हम आपसे कर ही चुके हैं. ये thick cuticle leaves reduced to spines ये हो ही चुका है आपका. The loss in the aerial parts of the plant is called transpiration. Conducting tissues in the plants tube nails xylem of it is a xylem. The structure of the plant where transpiration occurs: stomata of the leaves, lenticles, cuticle. Organ in which guard cells are located. Mention the main function. The guard cells are located in the leaves. They regulate the stomatal opening and transpiration and diffusion of gases and, and gases and closing and reducing transpiration. Name the process: transpiration. Photometer. It is an instrument used for measuring the rate of water loss due to transpiration. It measures the rate of transpiration in plants experimentally. ये सेम प्रोसेस है डिमॉन्स्ट्रेट ट्रांसपायरेशन एव ऑपरेशन ऑफ वाटर फ्रॉम द सरफेस लेवल ऑफ वाटर इन द ट्यूब विल गो नो चेंज अकर्स दिस मे टू बी अकर राइट व्हाई डू प्लांट्स एब्जॉर्ब मोर वाटर इन द रिक्वायर्ड बाय देम बिकॉज़ मोर वाटर रिक्वायर्ड बिकॉज़ मिनरल्स आर प्रेजेंट इन द एक्सट्रीम क्वांटिटी सो टू ऑब्टेन ड्राई कोबल क्ले फॉल्स ए हायर रेट ऑफ इट्स गॉड इन विंडी डे बिकॉज़ व्हेन इट कॉसेस फास्टर मूवमेंट ऑफ एयर फास्टर डे ऑपरेशन ऑफ वाटर एंड देयरफॉर हायर रेट ऑफ transpiration especially light energy in the presence of reduces carbon dioxide synthesis see that's why the function of light energy is the process of photosynthesis is to reduce carbon synthesize split water fill in the blank stomata transpiration hydrothotes lenticles stomata are hydrothotes uh, lenticular transpiration i hope we have explained you each and everything any doubt anywhere you can ask me in the comment box again we will meet in the next video thank you children